months ago, a big YouTuber named Russo Plays hired me to make a map with a bunch of worlds and a bunch of, uh, you know, islands and all that stuff. And the highlighted comment of that video is this waterfall. Literally, so many people in that comment section and since then have all asked me, how do you make this waterfall? This tweet says we're almost at 10k followers and to celebrate, I'll be releasing this awesome old stylistic water set for you. Uh, and yeah, he hit 10k. So check this out, guys. This is the same waterfall. The bottom is a little bit different but all the streaks and all that stuff so you don't even have to learn how to make it you could just get it for free now and there's also these cool water animations you could put on top of your normal water anyways let's go get it it's right here guys i'll have the link down below in the description let's just grab the model and see what we could do with it all right so we have the two current water packs on roblox i've made a video on this one and uh it's cool but it does kind of glitch out a lot like just I don't know not exactly the most clean and now we have dev for hires which uh, I mean This is literally the guy who changed roblox low poly forever by releasing the first ever texture pack on roblox So I'm ready to check this out and see what we could do with this water Ooh, does he have a new way to make the water as well? That's really clean. We have the top foam. Of course. We used to have four four bits to this. Let's grab the bottom Oh glass. I'm gonna make it a little less transparent. So it's a little more bright for me. That's what I like. I think it looks pretty good. And then we have this. Let's just ungroup everything. We have our waterfall. I'm gonna duplicate that and bring it over. We have a water effect, which is right here. Let's duplicate that as well. Kind of drag that over. It's not letting me just pick it up for some weird reason, <laughs> but let's drag that over as well. And now we have my water set. Just changed some colors. We could group this back together and throw it to the side. And now let me think of what I could build to show off this waterfall. Alright, so I've got this beautiful rock and this beautiful mountain and now we're just gonna make everything work together and hopefully make a little scene i want to try to avoid making this like extremely massive so i'm gonna try to stack two of them next to each other just because i think it might be a little cooler for the top something like that and then we could have another one of these over here bring it down some maybe out throw those on the other side all right so far so good we're gonna duplicate the top of one of these cv bring it down and then this could just be kind of a, a plane up here perfect and then we're gonna duplicate that bring it down and this could be like like a probably like a rock type color something like that maybe darker would look better yeah i think darker definitely looks better might as well grab these and scale them down all right let's go ahead and grab this guy throw it in the water maybe like right here and let's put one over here this one won't have anything besides the border pieces but this one we're gonna put the rock in just it. as a little decoration perfect now i need to figure out how i want to decorate the rest of this this could come down quite a bit more i think maybe out some more something like that and then this one as well just just change it up a little bit. We can give all these a little bit of rotation just to make them a little more random. It always looks better if you just add a little bit of like why to your to your scene. Why is it like that? Hmm. We'll tilt both of these in. I think that looks kind of cool. We definitely need a tree and let's duplicate this rock. Do something like this. Duplicate. Scale it in on both sides. What color green do we have? Shamrock. And we'll do something like this. Group those together. And I'm going to spread these around the bottom to kind of block in the water part here. All right. We have our little rock base area right here and I think it actually turned out really good. We're gonna grab some more of these rocks and place them sort of on the mountains, in the rocks, stuff like that just to add a little bit more detail to our scene here. And I'm just gonna place them kind of around like this just to have a little more going on. Make this one maybe a little bigger, give it a little rotation, throw it back a little. There we go. Let's throw one on the top as well. Turn it twice, maybe a little rotation, and then let's throw a small one up there as well. Maybe right here. Now what we need to do is maybe go get a grass piece and a tree model maybe? Let me find a tree model real quick. All right, went and grabbed this asset pack right here, Eno's asset pack, and uh, now we can check it out. I wasn't planning on using this one, but the toolbox won't scroll, so here we go. Ooh, maybe I could even put this boat in here. Yeah, okay. We could actually make this a lot cooler than I thought. I'm gonna go ahead and scatter some of these assets around in this little pond. Oh yeah, this is gonna be dope. We even have some lily pads. Throw one of those in there, cause why not? Maybe like right there and right here. Ooh, this palm tree looks so good and so weird at the same same time. I'm gonna just use this one. So we'll have palm trees and normal trees on this one. I think that'll look really cool. All right, guys, I just scattered a bunch of the assets from this pack all around this, and it looks very nice, actually. Of course, uh, the water does glitch out sometimes with the surface appearance on top of it, but other than that, it looks really, really good. I also changed this from that dark gray we had to cyan, because it's from this to this, you know, so it, the, the blue definitely helps. In fact, I might match all the properties with this one here, cyan, glass, and 0.15. We'll see how that looks. There we go. 
and now our color is a bit better matched. I really like how this turned out. And asset packs really do come in clutch, guys. There's so many free assets out there. So if you're not the best builder yet, make sure to hop on and just see what you can make with them. But guys, that is going to wrap up this video about this new water, uh, I guess free water stylized pack. I don't really know what to call it. But if you did enjoy and you want to see more content like this, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a great day. Later.